In this example, we will find a percentile of an exponential distribution. For some background on the problem, the random variable x is equal to the amount of time and minutes a postal clerk spends with his or her customers. The time is known to have an exponential distribution with the average amount of time equal to four minutes. And therefore, mu, where the mean is equal to four minutes, m, the decay parameter, is equal to one divided by mu, which in this case is one divided by four, or 0 0.25. And therefore, the probability density function is f of x equals 0 0.25 times e, raised to the power of negative 0 0.25x, which gives us the exponential distribution, which is shown here. And the cumulative distribution function is big F of x equals one minus e, raised to the power of negative 0 0.25x, which gives the area to the left of x. So now going to our problem, we want to answer the question, 70% of all customers are finished within how long, which would be the 70th percentile. So we're looking for some value of x, let's call it k, that would be, let's say, approximately here, where 70% of the customer times are less than or equal to k, and therefore the area to the left of k is equal to 0 0.7. So we can say the probability that x is less than k is equal to 0 0.7. And since this is the area to the left of k, it must equal one minus e raised to the power of negative 0 0.25 k, which gives us the equation one minus e raised to the power of negative 0 0.25 k must equal 0 0.7. And now if we solve this equation for k, we can determine the 70th percentile. So for the first step, let's subtract one on both sides which gives us negative e raised to the power of negative 0 0.25k is equal to 0 0.7 minus one, which gives us negative e to the power of negative 0 0.25k equals negative 0 0.3. Let's multiply both sides of the equation by negative one, which gives us e to the power of negative 0 0.25k equals 0 0.3. And now to solve this exponential equation with base e, we will rewrite the equation as a log equation using the definition of a logarithm shown here, where e to the power of x equals y is equivalent to natural log y equals x. Where x is the exponent, e is the base, remember natural log is base e, and y is the number. So the equivalent log equation is natural log because we have log base e. A logarithm is an exponent, and therefore the log is equal to negative 0.25k, and, and the exponential expression is equal to 0 0.3, which is the number part of the logarithm. Notice now to solve for k, we divide both sides by negative 0 Simplifying, we have k is equal to the quotient on the left, which we'll get our decimal approximation for. We have natural log 0 0.3 divided by negative 0 0.25. To four decimal places, we have approximately 4.8159. which means 70% of customers are finished within 4.8159 minutes. Which also means 4.8159 is the 70th percentile of finishing times, meaning 70% of the finishing times are less than or equal to 4.8159 minutes. Now I also wanna mention there is a quick formula we can use to find the percentile k given by this formula here. And let's go ahead and just verify we get the same value. We would have k, the 70th percentile is equal to natural log of one minus the area to the left, which is the 0 0.7, divided by the opposite of m, which is negative 0 0.25. Simplifying, we do get the same expression for k of natural log 0 0.3 divided by negative 0 0.25, which we already saw, 
does give us approximately 4.8159. So if your instructor lets you use the shortcut formula, it's obviously much faster than solving the equation algebraically. I hope you found this helpful.